Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to see how we can uninstall software remotely. So there is a command from the Microsoft get hyphen package and then we can use the uninstall hyphen package. So get hyphen package is to get the information about the package whether it is installed on your computer or not and then selecting that package and then uh, again giving the pipe and uninstall hyphen package is again the same command to uninstall that software. So this is a simple script. I haven't added uh, many things or many information in this script. So you can use that for uninstalling the software. Now how we uninstall the software that we will see later. We have a four computer in our lab. One, the domain controller from where I'm running the command. I'm running the command with my administrator uh, login. So it won't ask me for the username and password to uninstall that. And uh, here we have a three computer uh, where you can see the seven zip and the adapter reader is installed on all three computer. And we are going to uninstall that. Okay, so we'll, we'll see that how, uh, whether it is really uninstalled the software on the remote computer or not. Here is the script uh, where we have used the server's variable and we are getting the computer name from this text file. So let me show you how many computers are there in this text file. There are three computers, one, two, three. Okay, and everywhere the top and 7 zip is installed. Then again, we are using the for each loop here and we are invoking the command on the server and the script block is gate hyphen package hyphen name so here we are giving the package name and uh, if you don't know the full name you just have to give the starting character and then you have to put the asterisk sign as i have already given right adobe acrobat reader and then i have given the asterisk sign and then seven hyphen zip and then again i have given the asterisk sign so you can use in this way to uninstall the software so uh, again we are using the pipe here and we are giving uninstall hyphen package then we have used the error action silently continue. So if there is any error with this package, it uh, it won't stop the script. It will proceed further. Okay. So here we are uninstalling two software at the same time. Uh, so we are giving two lines. If you want to uh, suppose you have another three three application that you want to uninstall at the same time. So you can just copy paste. You can just comma here. You can just copy paste. You can comma and again copy paste okay so you can do like this and it will uninstall all the software from your computer okay so here currently i'm using only the two software uh, let's run this script and we'll see how it is okay we have started the script now it will try to uninstall the software from the remote computer so we'll monitor that okay okay so uninstalling msi package adobe acrobat reader dc so it is uninstalling something from maybe from the first computer yeah right from the first computer it is uninstalled the adobe reader uh, okay seven zip also completed we can go here and verify yes so it have uninstalled the both software at the same time on the one server and it will continue to uninstall from the second and the third computer. This script have a limitation. I'll show you that later. Once we have this un uninstallation done. Okay. Okay, so it have uninstalled all the software from the remote computer. You can see here, nothing is left. 7-zip and Adop, both gone. Now, uh, this script you can use and you can, uh, if you have any doubts, you can put into the comment box and I'll try to answer that. I just wanted to show you the limitation that we will cover in the next video. So we have here Notepad++, right? And we should able to uninstall that, like the Adop and the 7-zip, correct? So uh, let me do one thing and that is installed on the computer too. So let me remove this uh, both computer because it is no use. We have a work on the second computer. So currently I have only one computer in my ex uh, notepad uh, text file. Now here, let me delete this as well. Okay. And here I'll put notepad. Okay. So when I run this script, 
it will not uninstall this notepad let me see see notepad is there and let let's watch if the script okay so it gave this warning message but it didn't give the package name that it had been uninstalled so it um, it only uninstalled the packages which have the msi installer but there is another method that we can do in the next video thank you for watching the video